You get the kind of money when you go here, you, you go confused. Eh. And now it's happening inside Senate. You could just, they could just, they could, these people they don't get caught. They could just, they call money. They, 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 I said, they, 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 they even take the call the money self. It could be like, say, the money, now water. <laughs> eh, MDDC. Niger Delta Development Commission. They carry their budget 2024. I don't know whether that's supplementary. I've been away to carry enter Senate. But wait to this Tinubu budget of how many uh, trillion? All these agencies of government, their budget not the inside. Because I don't they all this I don't understand. The last time it was FCT budget that they considered 90 something billion. Eh. Now, that one is supplementary for FCT, as though they don't give the money for that Tinubu budget. Now, NDDC is coming with budget, their own at 2020. Eh, trillion, no, this is not 2024 budget. The money where they even call out, I go allow you to watch the argument will happen on the floor of the Senate as you take touch the money where you are here now. Then, uh, Babi, Senate President, my guy confused. He said, What is this? If they try to cut the money, if they bite in tongue, at, at the point they say, ah, this money too big, oh. it's too much for me to pronounce. <laughs> <laughs> Shall the letter pass a more? I'll be past first reading. Yeah. Because whatever that happens, see that go talk, like I say, they know it, they talk. But last, last, they go stay, all of them go share the money now. I will allow you to watch that video. Watch it to the end, then come to the conversation and tell me, what you think about this money we 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 you are here now and this NDDC any the usefulness of this NDDC is there any state captured in the NDDC that can stand side by side with Lagos State in terms of development with all the money that has been given to NDDC don't get me wrong some of you will come to my comments and start talking. Eh, to nobody develop Lagos. To nobody not develop any Lagos. Lagos, why? Are your money your own way? Don't forget that Lagos State was a capital territory before it was moved to Abuja. So it was already set on a pedestrian to develop. As we speak now, carry a madman and put as governor of Lagos State, he go perform. Because Lagos State is already just like moving, taking out, I'll be moving out FCT from Abuja to another place. And then one governor will come and say, hey, and I develop Abuja. I mean, I make Abuja the floor. Rubbish, rubbish argument. So no come, come talk that rubbish for my conversation. Uh -huh. NDDC. I, I'm beginning to think that that commission is useless because I don't know their work. If you know, put it in the conversation. But listen to the money. As in, the money we go here now. Eh? Ntige, chige. Help one, watch, help me watch this video. See as they take the call out money. Uh -huh. See as soon as uh, the senior president don't even pronounce the money because it's too big. See as they finally see those in favor, say I, I guess, any hey, boy, the eyes have it. Just watch it. Enjoy yourself. Put your two cents in the comment section. I will be waiting. Watch. Nine hundred and eleven billion. 800 million naira only for the Niger Delta Development Commission for the fiscal year 2024 as follows. Personnel expenditure, 38 billion, 545 million, 349,193. Overhead expenditures, 29 billion, 246 million, 506,753 naira. Internal capital expenditure, eight billion seven hundred and eighty five million five hundred and seventy four thousand one hundred and thirty one naira. Development projects, eight hundred and thirty five billion two hundred and twenty two billion two hundred and twenty two million five hundred and sixty nine thousand nine hundred and twenty four. Legacy projects funded by borrowing, one trillion. Total expenditure, one trillion nine hundred and eleven billion. 800 millionaire recommendations 
In view of the foregoing, the committee recommended as follows, that the revenue profile for the commission for the year 2024 is as follows. Revenue brought forward, 12 billion. Federal government contribution, 324 billion, 844 million, 833,046 naira. Federal government contribution in essence on paid areas by federal government and recoveries by the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, 170 billion. All companies contribution and Nigerian liquefied natural gas limited and others, 375 billion. Ecological funds, 25 billion. Borings, 1 trillion. Other internally realized income, 5 billion. Total revenue, 1 trillion. 911 billion, 844 million, 833,046 naira. Prayers. That the Senate do consider and approve the year 20, 2024 budget proposal for the Niger Delta Development Commission in the sum of 1 trillion, 911 billion, 844 million, 833,046 naira, only as recommended by the committee. Thank you. Mr. President, distinguished colleagues. Distinguished Senator Olami Leko. Thank you very much, Mr. Hart, by commending the chairman for his prompt response and <clears throat> quick presentation of his budget for NDDC for 2024. Well, Mr. President, that goes without one or two reservations. Number one, I expect the committee to give us a synopsis of what 2023 budget of NDDC is like. I observe they are silent about that in this budget. Even in the federal budget, in the national budget, containing it is the performance of the previous year's budget that will give lay a foundation for the consideration of the 2024 budget. So for this, I expect the chairman at least to guide us, to show us what it's like as far as the activities of the NDDC is concerned in 2023 concerning budget implementation. They are silent on it. We have no information. So if we go ahead and pass this 1.9 trillion budget for 2024, what we be what are we predicating it upon in terms of performances yes you might say it's the tradition or that's the standard but this is not at least good enough for the education of distinguished colleague as far as the appropriation bill of a particular agency is like and such a sensitive agency like NDDC. i want the chairman to please take cognizance of this so in his future presentation of budgetary provision uh, budget of NDDC. We will have a full idea of what is contained in the activities of NDDC. I will say that, Mr. Chairman, I want to say that um, all the projects are stated here. We should please, because I observe that $174 billion was for unpaid projects across. What are these projects? Where well, are the least that shows that they are really unpaid? All this clarification, we need to, at least the chairman need to go to the nitty-gritty of it, so that by the time the full implementation of this budget comes, it can follow it to the latter, and to ensure that the right thing is done as far as NDDC is concerned. I so sorry, Mr. President. Thank you, sir. And uh, one of the things that uh, came to my mind was that, yes, this is a, a bill that came from the presidency. But you know that before they can go a borrowing to the tune of one trillion, they must follow due process. They must follow due process. So I don't think this is the end of the discussion with them. And the committee on NDDC must do its best uh, to, to do the oversight function and to guide them properly. So I would like to put the question. Prayer uh, 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 5.0 that this Senate do consider and approve the year 2024 budget proposal for the Niger Delta Development Commission, NDDC, in the sum of 1 trillion, 111 billion, 844 million, 833,000, 
and 46 Naira only. Those in support of this recommendation say aye. Those again say nay. The eyes of it. Accordingly, the 2024 statutory budget proposal of the Niger Delta Development Commission in the total of 1,911,844,000 833 naira and 46 I'll take that again 1 billion 911 1 trillion 911 billion 844 billion 1 trillion this money is, uh, is too much for me. One, one trillion. I hope you, I hope that is not, I hope that is not on the record. <laughs> one, one trillion, nine hundred and eleven billion, eight hundred and forty-four million, eight hundred and thirty-three thousand and forty-six naira is hereby approved and passed. Imagine a country where its citizens get to enjoy the road without this. Imagine a country where unprecedented fuel scarcity does not cause panic at the filling station. That is why Innocent Vehicles has embarked on manufacturing environmental friendly gas powered cars while still offering comfort, luxury, and doggedness for the African roads. Innocent Vehicles, the pride of African roads.